that's that's a level of complexity I'm not sure if everyone's uh, prepared for. So. What's up, guys? Lon here from Android Authority, and I'm joined here with Chris. And we just got out of the Chromebook uh, session here at Google I.O., uh, where they announced some pretty big news about Chrome OS. And Chrome OS is pretty awesome if you ever used it. It's really simple, very fast, uh, easy to use. Uh, and that simplicity is a little bit of a double-edged sword because uh, you can't do more intense things like edit photos or videos or play uh, high-end games. Uh, but that's about to change with what they announced here today. So uh, Chris, do you want to go ahead and tell them exactly what it was that they talked about? Sure. Uh, well, the big news, of course, is that Android apps are now coming to Chrome OS later this year. Over a million Android apps will be available on Chromebooks in the coming months, obviously opening up a huge amount of potential for Chromebook users as well as for developers of Android apps. A massive, massive new audience uh, for Android apps. Uh, Chromebooks, uh, sorry, Chrome OS has actually just become the second most popular OS in the US with Chromebooks outselling Macs uh, for the first time. So. Yeah, it's probably pretty massive news, both for developers and for users of Chromebooks and Chrome OS. Yeah, I think it's pretty awesome that we're going to be able to get all these uh, Android apps uh, in Chrome OS because not only is this going to increase uh, your pro productivity with Chromebooks, but it's also going to increase your multimedia experience. So you're going to be able to download pretty much any app that is on Google Play. You're not limited to uh, anything really. Uh, you can download uh, Snapchat, you can download uh, Twitter, Facebook, all the social media apps. You can download any games that you want to play, like Clash of Clans was an example that they showed. So if you have a, a touchscreen supported uh, Chromebook, you, you can take advantage of games that are that rely heavily on touch. So uh, it's pretty awesome. I think it's going to be uh, going to open a lot of new doors for what you can do on a Chromebook. So uh, what do you personally think about uh, all these Android apps coming to uh, Chrome OS? Well, I mean, it's very exciting for sure. One of the things I'm a little concerned about, I mean, Google is saying that the transition phase will be pretty simple. You know, you can, developers can test their apps already to, to see what they need to do. Um, but considering the amount of problems we've had just getting tablet optimized apps, I kind of wonder how long the transition period is going to be to get a really uh, rewarding uh, Android app experience on a much larger screen. I mean, most tablet apps are just blown up versions of a, of a smartphone uh, designed app. So I wonder if we're going to have a fairly lengthy process where a lot of apps on Chromebooks are just going to be even more blown up. And that's just kind of going to be a little bit ugly. I mean, things are going to need to work with touchscreen keyboards, shortcuts, and a mouse. Um, and that's, that's a level of complexity I'm not sure if everyone's uh, prepared for. So hopefully developers will get on board very quickly. But I feel like there's going to be a lot of not so pretty uh, app experiences on Chromebooks in the near future. Yeah, that is sort of my concern as well because they did talk about uh, being able to Snapchat on your Chromebook, but Snapchat is a portrait-oriented app and Chromebooks are obviously everything's in landscape. So I'm not entirely sure how apps like Snapchat are really going to work unless developers uh, or the developers of Snapchat, Snapchat make the app uh, support landscape mode uh, because otherwise it's just going to be a really awkward experience the same way it doesn't really work all, the, all that well on a tablet. And as far as when it's going to be coming. They did say a few weeks for de de developers and uh, a few Chromebooks will be supported at the time and then they're going to be rolling it, rolling it out to more Chromebooks in the future. So a lot of very exciting stuff. But uh, that's pretty much it as far as our thoughts on the Android apps coming to Chromebooks. Uh, there's still a lot more to come here at Google I.O. 2016. So stay tuned for the rest of our coverage.